So today we have some funny back to school videos. I have three lives. If I laugh three times, I get suspended. <laughs> that doesn't count. Let's do this. All right, what we got? Teachers helping during a test. What's the longest river in the world? What's the longest river in the world? It's asking what year the Louisiana Purchase was. What year? What's the largest and deepest ocean? What's an ocean? Now, which one is the largest and deepest? Think about that. This is too accurate. All teachers do this. You ask them a question about a test, they'll read the question in a different way and not help you at all. You just finished a 30 minute test in five minutes. You need to check your answers. That is way too accurate. Everybody knows a teacher that does this. Back when I was in school, this happened to every teacher, literally every teacher. Dudes, do me a favor. If you've ever been to school, hit the like button down below the video. And if you're not lying, the like button will turn blue. <laughs> that laugh didn't count again. Yeah, <laughs> still got three lives. Okay, let's do this. And Zach, you start us off. So, uh, for, for my presentation, can it? Oh, lagging on Zoom, I okay. Wait. Okay, yeah, it's normal. I don't get the Wi Fi. All right, Zach, your signal's uh, breaking out. No. I'm sorry. Uh, Morgan, let's go on to your presentation. Uh, yes. No way that worked. That's too good, though. Guys, don't do that. Be, be present in school, okay? You know, do your work. Oh, no, he's cheating. Hey, stop cheating. The teacher saw it. You're about to get caught. No. He has a screensaver picture thing of his phone, like the back of a phone. So whenever he flips it over, it looks like his phone is sitting face down. So he can't be cheating. No. Guys, don't cheat in school. Listen, do the best you can in everything you do. Don't do that though. Oh gosh. All right, what we got? Once you are done. What does that do in the bottom left? <laughs> With your <laughs> noise boards. <laughs> what was that dude in the bottom left? Doesn't that kind of look like The Rock? All right, what we got next? What is this? Having a rough day of teaching, waiting for my next class. All right, we got a PE teacher. We got a gym teacher. That's good. We all know that guy. We all know somebody in our school that is that kid. And if you are that kid, you know, good job. You know, you know it's good. Making everybody happy. I can't say I was. I usually was, you know, the one crawling around the school because I was dead. What? Let's keep going. What we got? Today in my online class, my professor was talking about dimensions and he said one dimension and wrote 1D on the board. Okay. So I sent a video to my friend saying one dimension, more like one direction. And here's what happened. This is why we mute ourselves, kids. Okay. One dimension, more like one direction. <laughs> oh, the teacher heard it. Yeah, one dimension. Uh, who, who's talking? Oh! I think it was a joke, Professor. Just keep going. Yeah. I hate, I hate missing jokes. Oh, this poor teacher. He said, I hate missing jokes. Oh, this is mean. Oh, that's so mean. That poor guy, he just wanted to feel like he fit in. Oh, that's kind of sad. This teacher looks so nice. Uh, what we got? What's the next one? Last day of school in 2017. Oh, gosh, that was like an avalanche. What the heck? Last day of school in 2021. One. <sighs> We're good. We're good. Yeah, that's the current world we live in. We're good. Let's keep going. Oh. Apple. 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 Why do those apples have holes in them? Nobody's gonna know. 437 words. Nobody's gonna know. They're gonna know. They're gonna know what? How would they know? No! Guys, don't do this. So you guys know whenever they give you an essay and they're like, Def, we need a 500 word essay. This dude wrote like 430 words. And then he went in between the spaces, spammed a bunch of letters, and then turned those letters into white text so you can't see it against the white paper. And whenever the teacher loads up this document, it's gonna show over 500 words, meaning that they met the quota. Don't do this. Try to do the best you can in everything you do. Don't be this person. My friend recorded me looking at the test I didn't study for. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, it's, just, it's about right. Yeah, it's about, it's about right. That's about right. What is this? Uh, syntax error. Syntax. Oh, we're good. We're good. Yep. He just, yep. He's just putting in syntax error for every single answer because that's what he typed in the calculator. That's what the calculator said. So you write that in. Yep. Morning, class. Morning. 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 Uh, School in 2021. Today we are taking the final exam. I hope y'all use the study guide. Yeah, sure study guide. Because none of those questions are on this test. Now, the final is on 13 chapters of things we never went over in class. The final is not multiple choice. The final is 50 questions. I need three paragraph answers for each question, including a 30 page essay on the back. The final is worth 100% of all of your grades, meaning if you fail this final, you get an F in every class you're taking this semester and you get dropped from college. Any questions? Are everybody ready? No, nope. yeah. I think so. Okay, you may begin the exam. Pencils down! Pencils down! Pencils down! That's it! That's it! That's it! It's over! It's done! Time's up! Pass the test! That is child abuse. What the heck? This is what I think where you sit in class is about how you act. People in the escape okay. zone sat in the front row so that they'd look like a good student, but they actually just wanted to be as close to the door as possible. They're watching the clock doodling, ready to leave. Yeah, okay. These are your stereotypical front row people. They're raising their hand every five seconds, asking a million questions, and weirdly trying to prove to everyone how smart they are. Yep, middle front section is usually the sweats. Yeah, those are the, the, the people in Fortnite who crank 90s. These people might not be as good at school, but their plan is to become best friends with the teacher whose desk is right there. They'll just try to get them off track, talk about anything other than class. In the loud zone, you got people talking, to each other okay. passing notes laughing the whole time let's be honest it's a fun place but like 50 percent of it's for attention from the whole class and the teacher and they secretly do care about class yeah the left side of the room was usually where i sat yeah it seems about right seems about right it'd be a hot take but these people can be fantastic students just without asking as many annoying questions they might not participate as much as everyone else but they're gonna get the highest score on the test yeah. i don't know what it is about this spot right here but these people actually don't care about school they're never gonna turn anything in getting weird fights with your teacher and it's just not a great energy yeah yeah back right that's it's always back right too. I sat back right once. I think it was in high school and it was like during a uh, history class. I don't like history. <laughs> that wasn't a laugh. I sat back there in the slacker zone, right? And I'm not kidding. We had a substitute teacher. One of the kids back there picked up a roll of toilet paper. When the teacher walked by, threw it at her back, she had no clue who did it. Don't sit back there. Don't be those people. They're not good people. Teachers fake leaving when class won't stop talking. Excuse me. Write names down, giving check marks. No, nope, you can keep talking. Oh my keys. Hand me my keys. Guys, oh my God, I didn't laugh, I didn't laugh, we're good. This lady is so good at teacher reenactments. That is so, how many teachers that you guys that went to school with left the class? I know at least five. You had two tests. I did this. You got a 53 and a 60. You can cheat. It's online. I did cheat. And you still got a 53 yes. and a 60. Was that her dad saying you can cheat because this is an online school? All right, what do we got? Public school check. Oh, wait, what is this? Ah! <laughs> Hang it! I thought I was gonna win this with no laugh. <laughs> Public school check. This is like you got the fancy gold uh, soap shooter. You got the nice faucet with the uh, sensors. This is the school that I went to. <laughs> Facts. That seems about right. <laughs> All right, what do we got? Oh, I love this lady. She's so good. The sound effects teachers make. The cow. Mm. Car start, okay. She is so good at that. Holy crap. Okay. What the hell? My report card? Oh no, no, 
That's no good. How does a dog fail school? You're back from school already? Dad can't go him. Get the tape. Hey guys, how was school? Good. What are you hiding? Crap. Olivia, is that your report card? Yep. Yeah. Why is it on the ceiling? Just get her grades up. No, 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 uh-uh, nope. That's not okay. You do not make an entire video for one joke to put a report card on the ceiling so you can tell your dad that you want to get your grades up. The way our parents had to travel to get to school in their stories. Oh, this is going to be good. Yeah. That is too good. You guys know the old people stories thing. Whenever they tell a story about how they traveled, we had to go uphill both ways. There was a hailstorm, but there was also lava. It's like, what are you talking about, Gramps? And I also had to eat a cheeseburger with a donkey. What are you saying? Part two, students calling teachers by their first names. Don't do this. Dude. Are you serious? <laughs> you call me by my first name. <laughs> <laughs> Are you still calling me by my first name? Hey, Tawana. <laughs> hey, Brenda. Do not call me by my first name. I'm an adult. You call me Mrs. Maddox. Love you. What's up, Joe? I'm trying to eat. <laughs> hey, Reggie. What? Office, Carico. Office. Hey, Connor. What? Take some advice. Do not call your teachers by the first name ever. Don't do it. I'm speaking from experience. Let's keep going. Taking attendance in 2050 part four. Do we have a susa ta? It's forest. For s ta. Oh no. Plus I, son. It's Addison. Addison. Get it right. <laughs> then do we have a. I emoji sec. It's Isaac. Are you serious? <laughs> You're the one with an emoji in your name. Then we have A B C D E Absidy. Absidy. <laughs> Good one. Absidy? Are you kidding me? It's probably Matthew. Actually, it's Matthew? No, Matt the W. Matt the W? Ah! Mm -mm. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I can't, I can't. Mm -mm. 2050, mm -mm. don't let it happen. We are better than this as humans. All right, what we got? Boy high schoolers in the halls, senior. All right, we got, we got okay. I just chilling. All right, junior, kind of sad. Sophomore, kind of oblivious. And freshman. <laughs> With a left uppercut like that. What the heck? Have you got the senior, the cool kid about to go to college, or you know, junior sad, sophomore, like, you know. Oh gosh, that's too good. Dang it, I have one life left. Alright, what is this? My accounting professor hosted an exam review session as a potato part two. <laughs> I just to be honest, once you are the potato, you can't get it off without leaving Zoom. <laughs> So, you're stuck with me. All right, uh, let me just check on my uh, family first. Uh, see where I'm uh, Mom, no, my baby. <laughs> That's stupid. All right, let's get serious. All right, time to get this thing off. There we go. All right, so uh, we're gonna do a review session today. <laughs> Sorry, it's been a long day. Oh, dude, we need more teachers like that. All right, nobody, me escaping the principal. No, are you gonna sink down? Oh, dang! All right, what we got? Seen in the quintessential monument structure as laid out by Joseph Campbell. None of this is real! Thank you, Declan. Some 50 or 60 years ago. Thank you, Declan. How do you not bust out laughing in the middle of class? All right, what we got here? Somewhere in Canada, present day. 
I got an A? She, 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 she. I don't know what else to do. I think that's good enough for us. For you guys that don't know, that's Nico Vault. Just, I don't, who? you like this nico guys if you have enjoyed this hit the like button hit the subscribe button if you're new around here click this next video to watch the next video i'm sorry that nico had to put you through that suffering